Welcome everyone to Trade with Rob, brought to you by WealthBuildersHQ.com. This update is for Thursday, the 7th of March, 2024. Hope you're having a great day. Hope it's been a great trading day for you. Uh, as we do get started, keep in mind everything we look at is for education. Nothing's meant to be advice or recommendations. So we've got a lot to look at here today. Uh, the very first thing I want to go through is the S&P 500. So let's kind of zoom in on that a little bit for now. Let's really bring it in. So we're up a little bit today. Market literally just closed. I started recording, trade station went ding, 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 and I had to redo it again because I didn't want that in there. But we're up 26 points right now. We just closed seconds ago. So overall, we got back above that 52, uh, 5100 again. We're looking at that 5138 is our next upside target. And that 5057 is the first downside target. Kind of looking like a switchback setup to me on the S&P, meaning we can go in either direction. The important thing was today we closed back in bullish territory instead of bullish neutral as we were yesterday. So the very first stock we're going to look at today is CVX. Let's get a bigger picture. We want to see the entire FIB, right? The FIB itself is great. It's all good. So I'm going to zoom it in now just so we get nice and close. And we closed down in bearish territory today, even though the market's bullish. Uh, we closed down on Chevron, uh, what are we down? A buck and a quarter today. So if we could push back up to the 150 level and fail, we're looking at 144 and three quarter is support. So four, five, six, about 146-ish, 46 half or so is going to be our downside target. If we break above that 150 level, pull back and bounce, we're looking at 154.38 is resistance. So right about 153-ish, give or take is going to be uh, a considerable target. All right, so that's one and done. That's first one in the books. Let's look at the next candidate, which is EA. You want to see the entire FIB? All right, live is good, baby. Live is good. All right, great switchback setup here. So we're sitting right near that 135.09 level. If we retest it, move up tomorrow, also in bearish territory. If we retest it and fail, we're looking at that 133 is our support. So right about 134, 34 and a half. Some of that area is going to be our target. If we break back above that 135, we're looking at 138 and a quarter is resistance. So right about 137, 136 and three quarters, somewhere around there is going to be our target, All right? So that's number two. And then number three is SWKS. Let's go back and look again, bigger picture. Great fib channel going on there, right? We've played nicely between fib lines here over and over again. So I like the setup. It's a great switchback. We're in a bullish territory right now. If we could pull back to the 103 and a quarter and bounce, we're looking at 107 and a quarter is resistance. So right about 106 is our target. If we break the 103 and a quarter, retest it and drop, putting us into a bearish territory, we're looking at $100 even as support. So right about 101 is our target. And there we have it, ladies and gentlemen. Have a great rest of your day. I'll see you all in our next update. Bye for now.